Hey, I'm sharing with you one of the assignments I made for the course I'm working on. It's about spine and covers everything. We will have assignments with videos and files and quizzes where you can get grades and a lot of tips full with GIFs explaining how it works. For now, just enjoy the assignment and you can post the result on the Discord server in the description. I'm going to check them all personally. Thank you very much. And this is your next assignment. Open example project called Spine Boy. What I want you to do is practice with transform constraints. So it is very common to detach a weapon, in this case the gun, from the body to animate it separately once it is released from the hand. For that, we need to use transform constraints. Let's select the root bone and create a new bone. Select create tool and click wherever you want. Now select the bone that contains the gun and click transform constraints, selecting as target the newly created bone. That's it. Let's move to the animate mode. Activate that animation. Stop at the frame where we want to detach the gun. Find that bone. Press Ctrl C to copy transforms. Select the new bone. Press Ctrl V to pass transforms. Make sure you are in the world space. Now the new bone will perfectly be aligned to the bone that contains the gun, but it is still not controlling the gun. To do that, click on this annotation that will select the constraint we just created, click link sliders and set full value. You can see we have created a key for transform constraints that make sure that starting from 10th frame, we will have full control for the transform constraint. Now let's move the bone. And if I rotate the shoulder, you will see it doesn't control anymore the gun. We are ready to select that bone and animate it however we want. Thank you.